Bye, guys. I love you. Hold your read. Wait for me. I'm coming. Just because we're now you have to, uh, English, you know English, you think you're better than everyone. Well, Big Brother chose me with my small English, and I'm not going to stop singing because you guys said, hey, Yolanda, you must stop singing, you're making noise. Because when the whole house is singing, no one is saying anything. But because it's Yolanda, what you gonna do about it? Nothing! No. Chuen, I told you that when you like taking my things and making them yours, first they said you're the most stylish, now you're trying to take my, my words. Guys, to be quite frank, the final wager presentation is the best presentation of this Big Brother Zamzi season 4. Honestly speaking, I really enjoyed myself. Yo, what a wager presentation. What a beautiful, awesome, amazing wager presentation. Honestly speaking, I was entertained. Our top six really came prepared for this wager presentation like they killed it. Like they nailed it. Big Brother couldn't even help but give them their 100% win. Because, guys, yo, they deserve it. In fact, they gave us 200%. In fact, if there is anything like 500%, they gave us complete 500%. They didn't even leave any stone on turn. The way Papa Ghost impersonated young Papi. The way he impersonated Chueza. Guys, yo. My name is um, Mutusimang Christopher Bika, but they call me Young Papi. You know the Papi level, Papi Nation. I pay, I pay, I pay. Guys, was that Young Papi or Papa Ghost? Honestly speaking, I was confused. I don't know if I was watching Real Young Papi or Papa Ghost. Like the way Papa Ghost impersonated Young Papi. Guys, I was really, really screaming. <laughs> yeah. Guys, I never knew that this housemate, they can really impersonate the already evicted and disqualified housemate in that manner guys another one that shocked me in fact another one that got me gasping for air was watching mac junior impersonating Fahi. <laughs> honestly speaking tonight wager presentation is nothing less than great entertainment nothing less than fun in fact i really enjoyed myself i was entertained the way i was cracking up and to be quite frank with all of you guys, if you have really been watching all the wager presentation and you missed tonight's own, honestly speaking, you really miss out from a whole lot. Because guys, our top six housemates, they really came prepared. Mac Jr. impersonated Jared and Fahima. Guys, I was so, so shocked and surprised that see a slim person was impersonating people that are huge people that have body and he did it perfectly well he did it as though we were watching those people live i was just like wow this is amazing this is awesome like the way mac jr impersonated fahima that one said honestly he killed it he now well just take a look at how mac jr impersonated fahima I was screaming, like the way I was shouting, I was just like, yo, Mac Jr., you know what you're doing, brah, brah, you know what you're doing, honestly, because, ah, uh, watching a slim person impersonating someone like Fahima, Fahima that have hips and breasts, and he did it perfectly well, guys, mm -mm, Mac Jr. is a very good actor, and for Mpumi, Mpumi impersonated Yolanda and Palesa, yo, I was watching Mpumi impersonate Yolanda. I was thinking I was just seeing Yolanda in that house because, guys, the voice she was using, the way she was sounding, she was sounding nothing less than Yolanda. She was sounding as though it was Yolanda that was on that stage speaking. The way she was talking, her mannerism, the way she was carrying herself, the way she was speaking, and the way she was singing some of the songs that Yolanda do sing in that house. 
Guys, honestly, it was as though I was seeing Yolanda on that stage. In fact, just like the way Papa Ghost did bring young papi's personality fully on that stage, that was the same way Mpumi brought down everything that has to do with Yolanda on that stage. Watching Upumi, you could even think that it was Yolanda that was talking. And when she now impersonated um, Palesa, guys, I was just like, Mpumi, there is nothing you cannot do when it has to do with acting, when it has to do with entertaining. You will all, in fact, the way she was walking, yo, you could think that she was Palesa's twins or Palesa's duplicate because she was working exactly as Palesa during the presentation. And guys, the person that really, in fact, the way, the way Sinaye impersonated, uh, what's his name again? Uh, what's her name again? Um, else, guys, Sinaye. <laughs> in fact, you know, this has me, I won't lie to all of you guys, they really shocked me. There were certain things that I didn't know they could do perfectly well. When they were rehearsing for this major presentation, I wasn't really paying attention because I haven't really been around. You know, this week has been up and down and I haven't really been uploading video the way I used to do. So, you know, watching this major presentation without watching the rehearsal, without watching how they come, or come up with the presentation, Honestly, the way, in fact, watching it firsthand really made me, <laughs> it really cracked me up so, so bad because I was just like, guys, so these people can, well, in fact, you know, the, the win was really, really deserving. They deserve the win. That was why I said, if there is anything more than 100%, they would have even won. In fact, if it was, even though they wagered 1,000%, they would have won because Big Brother, the viewers, and themselves, they were entertained and they were very happy, you know, doing tonight's wager presentation. Did you watch the wager presentation? What's your take on that? In fact, you know, I just talked about Mpumi impersonating Yolanda and Palesa and the who again, Mark Jr. impersonating um, Jared and the Fahima. Guys, these are the few ones that I talked about in this particular video. Well, in our next video, I really think that I might be, I might be talking about the other ones because hmm, I, I, I do not really want this particular one to be overly long and boring. And I think this is the nice place. This is the perfect place to end this particular video. If you are new to my channel and you've not subscribed, please do wear Go ahead, subscribe to the channel, click on the notification bell button, and do not forget to like and share this video with your friends and loved ones that likes Big Brother Gist. I still remain your humble celeb city, the one with the legit gist.